What's going on guys, Joey here from Ultimate Gaming HD and welcome to episode 3 of the Call of Duty Ghosts Best Class Setups. Today we've got the Remington R5 which is an assault rifle and let's jump straight into it. We've got the silencer here as the first attachment followed by the foregrip. This gun can carry some recoil and both of these do help evaluate that very well. Um, I do recommend though if you want to remove the silencer and maybe add... Um, muzzle brake or uh, flash suppressor, but I'll just be using the normal silencer. Secondary weapon, we do have one. Progress, we're getting there. We have the M9A1 pistol, which I believe was a assault rifle in Modern Warfare 3. Just like the PDW is a pistol in this game. You know what? This is a new game. New stuff. Respect it. Respect it and I'll get you. We have the tactical knife as the... Uh, Attachment for the secondary weapon. We have no lethal here, but our tactical is a trustworthy nine bang, nine bang, nine bang, nine bang. Our perks here we have one one point perk of ready up, see, one, one, and we have four two point perks of sleight of hand, agility, marathon, and hardline. Now, strike package has been customized a little bit uh, for this class. We have the three-point streak of Satcom, the five-point streak of Guard Dog. <sighs> Just taking my breath, man. <sighs> and a seven-point streak of Trinity Rocket. Yeah, 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 yeah. That was unnecessary. I apologize. Um, this class, um, again, has not been used on this account, um, but you'll also see this be used now in the Call of Duty Ghosts live episodes. Stay tuned to episode 4, by the way. And, um, yeah, this class is very trustworthy. I recommend you do use it as of set out or add some customizations. But, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a like rating below, comment, and subscribe if you haven't for more Ultimate Gaming videos in HD. See you guys in the next video.